Stephen McFadden Sales, and today we're going to be going over the Bill Kelleher LTD Sparrowhawk Signature Model. So if you're not familiar with ESP and their line logic, it goes LTD, E2, ESP USA, ESP Original, ESP Custom Shop. The signature models fall into the LTD and the ESP Original buckets. So we're at the end of 2022 right now, and this guitar streets for $14.49, and it does come with a form fit case. So we're gonna be going over this guitar from end to end. Uh, let's start with the bottom. So starting off, you have a gold strap pin right here that goes into a mahogany body that is maple capped and finished off in this super high gloss black finish. That finish follows the guitar all the way through on the back, top of the headstock, front of the headstock. Uh, basically every surface is finished in that. From there, you have volume and tone wired into Seymour Duncan distortion pickups with custom gold covers. Now, both of these pickups are coil tapped, so you have a host of different tones that you can access using them. You have a wraparound gold Tone Pros bridge. You have a three-ply plastic pick guard, and you have a three-way toggle switch on the top horn. Bridge, both pickups, neck. This is a three-piece mahogany neck set through construction with a smoothed out heel joint right here. Uh, you can see you have your gold strap pin and white binding on the neck. Also, this is Macassar Ebony fingerboard and 22 XJ frets. Dig kind of the retro 70s, 80s-ish block inlays, and uh, you have dots on the top here. Back of the headstock, you have Bill's signature designed by ESP, made in Indonesia, the serial number, and you have gold LTD locking tuners right here. These things work awesome. This guitar stays in tune great. On the back, you have access to your pickups and you have access to your toggle switch. This guitar is lightweight. Uh, you can see the profile right there. It's not the thickest guitar in the world, which is awesome for on stage. Um, but it also, with that mahogany body and the three-piece mahogany neck, it does sustain very, very well. The electronics with the Duncan distortions are matched perfect to the body. It's a really nice setup. So the tones you're gonna hear in this video are basically straight out of this guitar into Pro Tools, and I use some amp modeling. It's just, uh, it's just kind of what came to my mind first when picking it up. So what I like to do with these guitars is as soon as I get them, just whatever kind of comes out, I record and that kind of gives me the vibe of what the guitar is. So enjoy. Yeah. 